Yes. Okay. Hello. You have gone at Iraq and you've won an award, right? Yeah, yeah. We didn't expect it, but we are very happy, of course. Uh, in particular, for the our avionics team that changed the entire avionics the, the day before the launch in uh, just a few hours. They've, they've done an amazing job. And uh, we got the Anacom Award for the, uh, the signal transmitted from the payload. So uh, like, uh, the, it was very clear and uh, uh, the frequency was very well defined. So we are happy about that. We, we can say that this was a successful Europe, uh, even if the recovery didn't really go as expected. Uh, but uh, the flight was good. We had a really good time. Uh, our team worked really hard and really well together. Uh, we had an amazing experience, uh, gathered lots and lots of new ideas. Uh, the flight, as I said, was successful. So we're really, really, really happy. And uh, this award is uh, only just uh, the final touch to this, uh, this experience. Do you want to go back to Europe next year? Uh, yeah, next year we will try to be to be here again with the 9K solid uh, COTS rocket. Uh, that will be the baseline for the integration with our bi-liquid engine. Uh, uh, so the two projects uh, will finally come uh, together uh, in the future. But first we have to de develop this bigger, uh, bigger rocket to test the systems and to be ready for the integration. So you're already working on the liquid engine? Yeah, yeah, the, the liquid engine is uh, uh, at a good stage of its, uh, its design. The, the study we've done this year uh, have, uh, have come to a result and we are just uh, waiting for the start of the production. But we, we are ready and we are confident to uh, be able to implement the, the, um, our engine for the uh, future years. Not next year, but, but the future years, yes, of course.